Understanding, Reading the Wind, A Guide to English Idioms. Hello, everyone. Welcome to our English language learning channel. Today, we're going to explore an interesting English phrase, reading the wind. This expression is a great example of how English speakers use idiomatic language to convey complex ideas in just a few words. So, let's dive in and understand what it means to read the wind. Reading the wind is an idiom that originates from sailing and outdoor activities. In its literal sense, it refers to the ability to observe and interpret the direction and strength of the wind to navigate or make decisions. However, in everyday English, it takes on a more figurative meaning. When someone is said to be reading the wind, they are sensitive to the nuances of a situation or environment, much like a sailor would be to changes in the wind. It implies a high level of awareness and the ability to anticipate changes or reactions based on subtle cues. To better understand this idiom, let's look at some examples. 1. In business, our manager is good at reading the wind. He knew exactly when to launch the new product. 2. In personal relationships, she could read the wind in her friend's tone and knew something was wrong. 3. In politics, the politician read the wind of public opinion and changed his stance on the policy. In each case, the person, reading the wind, is attuned to the subtle signals around them, allowing them to make informed decisions or understand deeper emotions. There are several expressions related to, reading the wind, that also use natural elements to describe human perception. 1. Testing the waters, trying something out to see how it is received. 2. Feeling the temperature, gauging the mood or opinion of a group. 3. Sensing the atmosphere, being aware of the emotional or social climate of a situation. Understanding these idioms enriches your ability to express complex ideas succinctly in English. That's all for our exploration of reading the wind and related expressions. We hope this has helped you understand not just the meaning of the phrase, but also how it reflects the creative and metaphorical aspects of the English language. Keep practicing, and soon you'll be navigating the winds of English idioms with ease. Thanks for watching, and see you in our next video.